think we are pretty much near the end. I think you saw on my loading screen that I... I had a problem that my game didn't want to work at all. Uh, I'm recording with Hypercam 2, but it didn't want to work after some time. I don't know why. That's why I try now... I, l I downloaded everything again and I even played the whole game to this point again because I thought maybe it was the game, maybe it just got some bug or something. So, yes. Jumpers now going back. Let's jump in. Because really I played one hour to get to this point again. I played so fast and I hope I don't have to do it again and I hope everything will run just fine. And yeah, let's just continue and really much hope that it finally will work. This is why you had to wait so long and I had exams again and uh, now I have a little bit more time and I really hope maybe we can finish this game. And please don't ask me what suddenly happened to Hypercam. I don't know, maybe you know. Maybe, maybe you know what happened to Hypercam, but I don't know. So, we'll see. Okay. <sighs> Remembering the voices? So, she went. What will she choose? I wonder. <laughs> I shall see this to the end. Okay. This is... It's like some storybook world. Better move on. Okay. Yeah, I got to this point. You don't know how many times I try to record this. And it's really freaking ironic that it's starting to have problems right in the end of my game now. <laughs> but I, I will finish this game, even if it's the last thing I will do on this channel, I will finish this for you guys. Mom! So you came, Maya. So it's really you, Mom. Mom! You shouldn't have come. Why? Why did you do this? You've seen it on your way here, haven't you, Aya? The atrocities this man continues to commit. I don't want any more victims of his. You lie! If anyone understood, Father, it was you, Mom. It's Maria you don't like, right? She loved father, so you didn't like them getting along. I know how you feel. I love father too, so I feel like Maria took father away. I was so scared, I couldn't breathe. <laughs> I know that. Yes, it's all as you say. I couldn't stand to see your father and Maria together. So, you still love father, don't you? So then why are you making him suffer? I don't want to make him suffer. I don't want to give him to anyone. So I'm taking him with me. You can't. Without father, I'll be all alone. I don't want that. I just wanted to live with father in you. Mom, take me with you too. That's not a good idea, Aya. <laughs> Please. I can't possibly do that. I want you to live and be happy. I can't. I'm happy when I'm a father and mom. So don't leave me alone. Oh. 
no one shall interfere. Mom! Now, honey, let us go. Let us go, let us go. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Father! Oh, she made it. Father! Oh, yeah. Why won't you listen to your mother? Don't take father away. Out of my way. Mom! No one shall have him. Mom, stop! He is mine alone. What's this, mister? Magic water, a product of my company. The power kept within the water shall no doubt be of help to you. I can save father with this, but what about mom? If your love reaches her, I am sure your mother can be saved. Really? Uh, I'm sorry if you hear some background noises. It's just... Um, my family is at home, so... Don't mind that. I'm really not sure. What should I do? Say father or grandmom's wish. You know what? I can understand for mother that she doesn't want any more victims. But we we go through this whole mess to save her father and there's no way we're gonna back back out now. So let's save the father. I'll save father. Ah oh, the perspective changed. Aya, what are you doing? I'm sorry, Mom. Stop, Aya. Uh -huh. uh. Oh no. I'm fading. My body is disappearing. Mom! Aya, 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 no, don't go! Aww. It's so sad. But she is already gone, so... But man, she is only like... 10, 11 years old, and she has to experience such a thing. Mm. Where am I? Father! Father! <sighs> mm. Was I saved? Oh, yeah. Aw. Father! Aya. I'm sorry, Aya. I worried you so. Father! Mom! Yes, I know. She must have been lonely. We'll visit her grave tomorrow, so her spirit won't be. Uh, okay. Aya. I didn't want you to know the truth, but with the last of my power... Huh. What? <coughs> I'm sorry. What? A fine sample. I shall dispose of the remaining materials myself. That can wait. Come, Maria. Doctor. Yeah. Doctor. She's 
she's aware of our relationship. Hmm, what does it matter? I don't believe she's fond of me. Oh, oh, ah, man. I skipped it, sorry. <laughs> but you can always pause the video and see it again. The girl will be 11 soon. It's a troublesome age, to be sure. Be kind to her, please. Make sure she is never harmed. She is my most precious doll of them all. What? <laughs> what? Huh? A doll? Me? Wait, is I a doll? Well, it would explain that she don't really like from the hair she doesn't look like her father or mother but what F father no we this can't be she's she isn't a doll it's like a bad joke we saw her be that she was little maybe, maybe she's an orphan that the parents picked up when she was very small and she can't remember this and she thinks that they're her real parents, maybe something like that, but no, this doesn't make sense. Was that... Huh? This is... Now what? Hmm... Mom! Yeah... That's her being all alive. <laughs> He's always spending all his time down in the basement. Don't tell me he's a fat girl again. Doctor, Mistress Aya has become rather ladylike. And to think she always used to tease you and bother you. <laughs> Indeed. Just a little more, I think. A little more until she's ripe. What? I want to make her into the most beautiful doll I can. Oh, so she isn't a doll, but she's going to be a doll. This, this isn't any better. <laughs> what was that? She shall be the masterpiece of all the dolls I've made. Dolls? What? Make her into a doll? Mom, what is this? I shall clean up the unnecessary materials myself. <laughs> Please do. I'll never forgive you. You'll never make our precious daughter into one of your subjects. Huh? Uh oh. You! What's the meaning of this? I can smell a conflict is coming up. Uh, are you planning to experiment on her? So you overheard. What are you thinking? She's a one and only treasure. So she, exactly, she's a wondrous daughter. So she is their daughter. She is their uh, daughter. Like they really, she, the mother really gave birth to her. So okay. I want to make her eternally so. And yet, she will someday be dirty. Like when she grows up and have another guy? Does he mean that? That I cannot bear to think. So I will make her a doll. I don't believe this. I'll never let you do that. I am leaving. What are you saying? If you want to make of. If you want to a doll of her so badly, just make a replica. Oh, you tell him. Wait, are you planning to take her away? That I cannot allow. Let go. I won't let you do what you will with her. Uh oh, mom. He did it. Uh, uh, uh. Poor Aya. 
Holy crap! My lady! My lady, stay with us! And Maria is shocked either. So. That's pretty messed up, man. Doctor, why did you do this? It had to be done for Aya's future. But, but, uh, my lady! Don't speak of this to Aya. But, she was already feeble. Say she passed away from a fit. I can't tell her. Oh, she's so sad. Are you refusing my order? N no, that's not what I... Maria. Whatever happens, I am loyal to you, Doctor. Because you are my assistant. Ah, Doctor. God damn it. He isn't even good looking. I don't know, maybe under his shades and glasses and I don't know, but he doesn't really look so attractive to be like loyal to him even with killings and subjects and killing own daughter and stuff. Now, how shall we dispose of a body? Naturally, Aya must not see it. Well, at least she feels bad. It's something. And this poor little Aya. Mom! I feel so bad for her. Is this a dream? Am I just having a bad dream? It's no dream. <laughs> this is reality. Mom! I'm sorry, Aya. Your mother still loves your father even now. Are you shitting me? <laughs> so, I didn't kill him. But I should have. Yeah, you should. Don't say that. Run away. Away from him. Uh-oh. I can smell a uh, running away scene. <laughs> God damn it. It reminds me... Right now I have a Vadano Hara flashback and it's no good. <laughs> it's not good. Aya? Uh. Aya, what's wrong? Why do you look so afraid of your father? Uh. Huh? Oh, this is a buddy. Damn, dude, you crazy! No, ma. Uh. Oh, yeah. What I just saw. Was it the truth? Father, you. Very well. Huh? Well, Aya. Don't you think your mom is beautiful? Uh. I suppose it's a bit much to take in. Oh boy. I just wanted a little more time, but... Father, you're going to make me a doll? Don't be sad, Aya. By making you a doll, your beauty can last forever. <laughs> Look at these children. Beautiful, yes. Prince of Justice were very than alive. This is the fruit of my research. None of them are moving. Am I going to be like that? Uh oh. You can hardly even tell their dolls, can you? But their heads, eyes, torsos, hands, legs, they were gathered from a wide array of people. Oh, this is. this is just sick, man. You're a mad father. Word for word. I find it quite fascinating. Combine a dog with a human if you so desire. Isn't that incredible? That's wrong, man. That's wrong. What would you like to be, Aya? Alas, I can make many changes while preserving, by preserving your loveliness. Father, stop. Ah, yes. Perhaps I'll dress you up finally. Tell me whatever you wish to wear. No! Aya. 
Why are you going? Come, be by your father. No. Are you refusing your father? I'm sorry. But I... I don't want to be a doll! That's a... That's right, girl. You don't want to be one. Mannequin doll. Okay. Let's save here. And I will be right back. I just have to check if the recording's still going well. Oh, please let it go well. And we'll see you right after a little cut. Alright, everyone, I'm back after this shortcut and. Yes, let's just. Let's continue where we left off. It's a mannequin doll. I have to run. Oh my god, no. <laughs> Alright. It won't open. Uh, yeah. Oh. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, mannequin. <laughs> open the door, Aya. The mannequin blocked it? Thanks. Oh yeah. Uh oh. Open. Uh, yeah. Oh god. Okay, I can't get closer. But Oh dear lordy. Please work and I'm really sorry. Oh my god. Jesus Christ, I hate the telephone. <laughs> okay, <laughs> it finally stopped. I'm very sorry about it, but I can't help it. And we... <laughs> oh God. Oh no. Ah, uh, yeah. No running away. No. Oh man, the poor mannequin. God damn it, let me out of here. Got to run. Ah! Ah! Yes. <laughs> no, get away from me. You crazy psycho crap. Ah! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh my god. Thank god. I just saw the lever, like, in the blink of a second. <laughs> oh, please, dear lord. <laughs> oh, it's... Oh, it's Maria. Where is this? W was I returned? Doctor? Let... Get out of the way, mistress. Maria, don't let Aya escape. God damn it. Let's get out of here, Aya. Wait! Oh, dear lordy. What do I do? Just keep running, don't stop. Not even a single second. Oh, yes, crow. Oops, <laughs> eh, yeah, well. Okay, a big pile of barrels. Light of shady drugs. What I do? It won't open. What do I do? Okay. What about going outside? No, she just don't want to go outside anymore. Alright, so, uh... Ah, here's no corpse. No corpse here. I got tight here. Okay. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Let's see what will happen. Mistress, where... Where did Aya go? I apologize, I lost sight of her. What? Uh-oh. Uh, I'm terribly sorry. I'm certain she could not be far. Let's search as... You useless! <laughs> oh god. This guy is a mad man. He's a real madman. Just going around and slaughter everyone. <laughs> Damn, dude. Did Father go this way? Father's oh, still looking. Uh oh. Oh, Doctor. Maria. 
what do I do? So much blood. Is there anything here I could use? Ah, oh, let's just save. Wait a second. I know this game has multiple endings. And... Maybe... Maria is going to... Leave Maria or help her. Now let's help Maria. Um... Let's just make this file data 5 and I'm going to go here, go back and stuff. Is there anything here? Maybe my gems will help her. <laughs> Got bandage. Oh, this is great. I mean, come on, he's some kind of doctor. So, she should have bandages and everything else around this place. A bandage? Well, I can't wrap this around your clothes. Looks just good, a little Maria. It's so sweet, we can help her. Even though she also tried to get us for the doctor. And she was still loyal to him, like I said. Even after the, he murdered her mom brutally. This should help stop the blood. Mistress, thank you, thank you for caring for me. I can't read today. Ah, uh, just so you know, I'm recording this part. Like I made a cut be in between, and I'm recording this like the other day. Like, yeah, I, I'm recording this another day, so I have to remember everything. But I still have it fresh in my mind, so I think I can, I can do it. Let's do this, Mistress. Thank you for caring for me. It's fine, don't worry about it. <coughs> I just voice still hurt my throat. I should be most loathsome in your eyes. Don't say that. It's true. I've known how you feel, mistress. I took away your most beloved. Of course you would hate me. But you are very kind to show me such compassion. Maria... Maria, can you stand? Mistress, let's get out of here together. But, mistress, I'm the same as you, Maria. Oh, I, I, I give her also. <laughs> I gave Aya for a second, but also a weird accent voice. I can't live without father's love, but if father doesn't want us. Technically, he wants you, but not as a person anymore or a daughter. He just wants you as a doll. So, yeah, you're kind of right. We've been abandoned. We have to live without him now. Even though you and I can't live alone. So, we'll help each other to keep living if, even if father's gone. Mistress. Can you just call her Aya or something like this? It's weird what she call it, keeps calling him mistress. I shall accompany you. That's sweet. Ugh. Hmm? Maria. Apologies, mistress. But could I have your shoulder? Yes. Oh, that's so cute. Okay. So, let's save here now and... Let's get away from here. Okay, so he broke this down. God damn it. Father. Mistress, hurry. Oh no. Maria! Mistress, never mind me, escape. No, we're leaving together. I can't go any further. You must escape alone, mistress. I it can't be. It, it is fine. I shall not leave you alone. I will follow behind for sure. Believe me, please. Maria. <coughs> I think I'm catching a cold, so I'm sorry. My voice sounds kind of weird sometimes. And this dude just, seriously, he just like... 
Did you see what he did there? He just like uh, almost yeah. ran over Maria. <laughs> oh, that planet. I found you! No! Get away from me! It's no time to stumble over Haya, no! What? Uh. <laughs> Come be with us! No! Oh god, damn it. That's enough of our game of tag, Aya. I have to keep you still, don't I? Let go! I didn't want to hurt you, Aya. It's a shame. No, stop, father. But I can cover your leg with a skirt easily enough, so it should be fine. This is... Can someone please kill him or something? Or just make him go away? I think I had enough for the rest of her life. <laughs> I don't want this. I want to stay with father. I love you, father. So please, stop this. Aya, don't worry. Father and Aya will always be together now. So rest in peace. Aya, I love you. Oh my no. <laughs> ah. Huh? Oh, oh man. Damn, son. You got wrecked. But uh, yeah. Father, I love you. Uh, yeah. Ah, ha, ha. Oh, it's Maria. That's good. Ah, damn. Oh, I, I almost thought she wanted to <laughs> to hurt Aya, but now, of course, the doll. Mistress. Are you hurt? <laughs> Maria! Oh! Father isn't moving. Did Father die? I apologize, mistress. I had no other choice left to protect you. No. Okay. I guess this is Father's best. What? Are you shitting me? No, this is no, this is not an end. This can't be. <gasps> is it, is it who I think it is? Or am I just imagining things? Am I just seeing stuff? No, it's him, the blonde guy. And I don't remember his voice completely. <laughs> uh, I have to make up another voice, well, or remember it. I'm glad I made it. Mistress! Oh. It's way too much. <laughs> it's way too much going on right now. Like, if I were Aya, I would probably do exactly the same. Only that I probably won't even be with the father. I would already run away, just the whole beginning is kind of messed up, but she is just a child, so yeah, but I, I feel so much, I feel so sorry for her, her whole like childhood is completely ruined, her family is gone, like both of them, but at least she has Maria, oh it's Snowball, that's cute, and maybe the blonde guy will come with her and be like, yeah, we're gonna be a party, a family. You saved us. Thank you. <laughs> Voices remembering. No need for thanks. 
I just did what she said, what she asked. You mean my mom? Okay. I said I was sorry for scaring you. I didn't intend to get injured. Believe that, at least. I understand. Mom wanted to protect me. Thank you, Mom. I want to see you again. She wanted that too. But I don't think she wanted to be seen as she is now. That's whatever Mom looks like. It's alright. She's watching you from afar. So don't be sad. If you are, it will only make her sad. These are true words, young man. True words. Right. The curse will wear off soon. So it's almost farewell. You'll go away? Aww. We're all alive now of a curse. I see. Oh, that's so sad. It's so bittersweet, man. But there's something I must do before I go. And that is set fire to this mansion. Huh? Why would... You can't do that. All those memories of being happy here. It's not my intent to burn those. But it's possible that someone could find traces of your father here. We can't let the same tragedy happen again. Is that what Mom wanted to? Hmm. Okay. If that's what if that's what Mom wanted, then do it. Mistress. It's okay, Maria. Even if this house is gone, the memories of father and mom won't go. Mistress. Can you please call her just Aya or something? This mistress is getting on my nerves a little bit. But I guess it's the time where you, like, in, in the time of the game, you probably call them like that. I don't know, but she, she was kind of like... A maid in the house, so yeah. Yes, that's right. I uh, there's one thing I ask of you. Do not ever forget the people who were sacrificed here. None of us had any relatives. No one looked for us. No one remembered us. No one knew we existed at all. This is so sad! No, don't make it even more sad than it already is. <laughs> but I guess he have to tell her because, yes, he and everyone else who was here probably... You know, like he's saying now, our existence will be forgotten to the world. Yeah, like, it's so sad. It, it reminds me of World War Two. It just... All the people who died, no one remembers them. And only because there's like no relatives and no one who cared for them. This is just sad. So I can understand that. He wants her to keep them in mind. But we indeed live, so I don't want you to forget that. I want you to hold proof in your heart that we were here. This is the least you can do for us. Yes, I'll never forget. Thank you. Well, this is goodbye. Oh, this is so cute! Goodbye, Aya. May you be smiled upon. Isn't it the charm? I remember it. I remember the charm. Wait. All you need is one thing and that 
you must have and that is love. So technically he loves Aya. Hmm. This is what I remember. <laughs> now go. Just come with us. We can try to keep you alive. Goodbye. Yeah, come on, snowball. Is she just going? Is he going to stand there and just burn alive? Huh? No, he goes somewhere away. Hmm. Oh, it's you. Oh yeah, you're still here. What's up with you? Humans are such utterly foolish creatures. I have seen countless many foolish humans, but you are the most foolish of them all. A human mad with desires more fearsome than any demon. And yet I adore such foolish humans. Come to me. Come to me and you may research to your heart's content. What? Where are you taking this crazy psycho? Don't make him be alive again with stuff. It is just the two of us now. Well, and Snowball? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, that's right. What shall we do now? I don't know. We'll have to find somewhere to live. But I'm sure I can't live alone. Maria, will you come with me? Yes, of course. You have taught me much, mistress. Now it's time for me to help you. Whatever awaits us ahead, I wish to protect you all the way. Thank you. Let's go. Are you sure? Without watching to the end. Yeah, it's fine. Hmm. Actually, wonder that the guy with a black coat went. Yeah. Even she's wondering. <laughs> I kind of want piece of pain. I'm sure he'll be alright. Well, he's a really strange guy. Come on, Snowball. Yeah. Father. Mother. Goodbye. Hmm? What's that? A book? Oh. Mistress? Hmm. What is the matter? Mm, nothing. Let's go. Oh, that's weird. The mistress is very hardy. Even after that harsh experience, she walks on without shedding a tear. I thought she's uh, cried uh, very much, but I mean. But she probably means right now, at this moment. With a mistress beside me, I feel we can overcome anything. However... What is this uneasiness I feel, Doctor? Oh, I don't like the sound of that. It's weird, what was in the book she had? It was some red book. And she didn't show it to Maria, so... I don't know. And what is that? This house looks gorgeous. And who are you? You look pretty. <laughs> uh, I have to... new voice. I am finally here. I have heard about this place. The Rebels Clinic. Clinic! Yeah, this must be the place. It's out in the middle of nowhere. No one would even notice it. 
Hmm. Let's see what's going on. So it's a clinic from someone. Hmm. Uh, um, hello? <gasps> it's Aya! Oh my god, and she's older! Oh, uh, she's... She's an adult grown-up. And she cut her hair. I'm just looking at her image right now. Oh, she looks so pretty. Oh, it's cute. And she wears, still wears with uh, blue clothes. Of course, with, um, with, of course, a larger size. But she looks, <laughs> she looks kind of the same, but still different. This is so cute. I like these things. Like you get a little bit more information what's happening. Like when she grows up. So, so, so this is a clinic, and she's there. Ah, a patient. <clears throat> I can I will give her my normal voice because she's now a grown up and I think I can give her my normal voice. Ah, a patient, welcome. She's so pretty. Yes she is. Is she the doctor? What seems to be the problem? Yes, well I was born rather feeble. I have asked my local doctor for a checkup, but how do I say this? My family is really poor, so the doctor gives doctor is giving up on me, and that's why I came here. I heard the doctor here does checkups for free. <laughs> I have something in my throat. I don't know what it is. Uh, yes, we don't ask any money from our patient patients, so don't worry. Really? I honestly don't have any, so... I can really get examined? Of course! Thank you so much! I can't do my normal... I can't do it right now. I don't know why I can't do my normal voice. Probably because my, fro my throat kinda hurts. What's your name? I'm... I'm Jean. Jean Rooney. Jean. That's a wonderful name. I'm Aya Dreves. Nice to meet you, Jean. So she is the doctor and it's her clinic and... Ah, okay. That's proof it's Aya. Yes. Yes, you too. Uh, <coughs> <coughs> that doesn't sound good. We should examine you right away. Come in, come in. Considering you're not all that healthy, your legs sure carried you a long way. Was it difficult for you? I met a kind old woman on the way here, who took me part of her way on the coach. It was so nice of her. There are some really nice people out there. Just like you, Dr. Travis. <laughs> you think so? Hmm. Everything looks fine to me. Like a clinic in that time. Wait. Now lie down here. Boy, I'm nervous. Oh, I hear horses. They don't sound far off. Are they in the back? Hmm. So, how is this? It's cute. Ah. Stay very still while I apply anesthesia. Ah, uh, yes. You have very pretty eyes, you know. Oh! So beautiful, I can't stop looking at them. Uh, no one said that to me before. Thank you very much. <laughs> Nervous, huh? It's fine, just relax your shoulders. Doctor. Hmm. Um, doctor, do you think you can make me better? Of course. From now on, you'll never suffer again. So take it easy and go to sleep. Uh oh. I didn't like how she said it. And I didn't like her things with her eyes before. And why are dolls there? And why? And this is a red book. Uh oh. Indeed, the mistress is much like you. It does run in the family. 
talked. What? Are you telling me that Aya has become exactly like her father in the end? But I don't believe it. I don't believe it. I mean, come on. She knows how bad it was, right? Wait. Let's think about it. So she's grown up and she found a book. Maybe it was a book how she learned to make people better. Maybe there was also stuff about... No, I don't know. What could be in the book? I don't know. I don't really know. Apparently this is a really end, like a true end, I think. But still... Oh, the picture is so cute. <laughs> but still, she can't be like her father in the end, right? So it doesn't mean I did the whole game and be like... Destroyed this whole tragedy only to create a new one. I don't think she created... I don't think she's like her father, but I don't understand what Maria means like... Uh, is this... is this what... Is this a father? I don't know. Ah, oh, and he looks different. Hmm. My, you've made a mess here again. Well, have you grown used to this lab? Oh. <gasps> it's Aya? Huh? Why is Aya there? Oh, wait. Ah, I skipped it. I'm sorry. <laughs> You still longed for your daughter, I see. Uh. I see, so her mature form served us. What? Yes, of course. She shall come into my world as well. Ho <laughs> ho, I look forward to her birth. What? I hope you can someday show that girl your home world. That sick and twisted... What? What is going on? We're always together. My adorable Aya. No! This can't be the end! I need a continuation. <gasps> and a picture! I saw this picture many times, but I didn't know where in the game because I didn't find the picture anywhere, so. And what's this? Oh, we have a gallery now. We can look at things. Characters, BMG, event, if... Oh. Hmm, let's see. Aya Dreves, a girl living with her father in North Germany. She's never going out in... She never gone out, gone out in public. She seems very young than her... She seems younger, even younger than her age. I can't read anymore. Oh. Oh. <laughs> She's so cute. Oh, I didn't know this picture. Oh, wait, what? That's cute. Ah, oh, it's so dark. Oh. Okay, so it's the father. Aya's father, Alfred, <laughs> conducts shady experiments in the basement. Okay. Maria. 
Power's assistant, a freeloader at Federer's mansion. Okay. Ogre, a mysterious salesman, helps Aya prove his story. Huh. Okay. Mom. Aya's mother, Monica. Monica. Oh, okay. So her name is Monica. Powers Alfred. Passed away from illness a year ago. But she was killed. She wasn't. She didn't pass away from the illness. <gasps> Although you can see the cut in her chest, like, when wherever power hits her. Okay. Blonde youth. A mysterious youth who appears before Aya. His true name is unknown. Okay. Oh, he doesn't even have a name. Oh god. Oh, that's much better. <laughs> He's so cute. <laughs> Snowball with Travis Pet Rabbit. There's no picture. Uh, Ines, one of our set test subjects, approaches Aya with a strange smile. Hmm. Oh, and where she was cut. Jean, a girl from a poor village. She visits the Travis Clinic to get cured. Oh. Okay. Subjects, victims of Aya's father's experiments. Oh. oh okay. BMG. I like this one. Coffee maker. Let's just play this one event. The strugglers. Oh. Look at them. Being all ugly. Mother's figure. Creepy doll. Father's madness. Something I didn't unlock. Appearance. It's weird. Mom's portrait. Experiment behind you. Eerie shelf. So this is really eerie. <laughs> old. Wait, what? Old odd rabbits. Okay. Calling puppet. Goodbye, dad. Goodbye, mom. Come with me. Yeah, but good luck charm. Here. It doesn't. It, it, even the description says. Oh, this is so cute. A thumbnail right here. <laughs> All right, and what is if? Let's see. What? Does it replay the murder? Uh, the murder. Does it replay the whole game again? Hmm. Mistress? Mistress? What? Maria, is that you? Oh, okay. Mistress, please come to. Is she all right? She seems to have fainted from shock. Of course, of course she would. Mistress. Oh. So this is a little bit like, uh, like the scenes that we didn't see because Aya probably wasn't, uh, wasn't awake at this moment. Oh, that's, that's, that's nice. That's good to know. This is interesting. Let's see. How's Aya? She's sleeping soundly. Just leave her for B for a while. Right. Uh, will you be alright? Don't worry about me. I mean, I'm already dead. Uh, are you truly a dead person? Huh? I'm sorry, you just seem different from the other corpses, somehow. I still sense life in your eyes, so it's hard to think of you as dead. Well, it feels pretty unbelievable to me that I'm up and about right now, too. 
Hmm. I'm sorry about before. I mistook you for, for an attacker, and so I am impulsively threw a knife. Don't worry about it. I probably would have done the same thing. Thank you for saying so. Oh, it's so cute. Mistress? Let's stay together. Mistress. Oh, she's so cute. Is she awake? No, I think she was talking in her sleep. Hmm. What are we going to do, I wonder? Not to mention you. The corpses are only being kept alive by the power of a curse. Once it's completely gone, I sure, I'm sure I'll vanish. I see. Even when you helped us so, I can't do anything for you. I'm truly sorry. Don't sweat it. The twist was always my fate. And no one can defy fate. Where would you be going? Feels weird sticking around in the girls' room. Can I borrow one of the other ones? I don't mind. Use any room that's available. Thanks. You have to live and protect Aya. That's your fate. That was Monica's wish too. Ah, oh, that's her mother. I remember. Which is why you were left here, I bet. I need not worry. I've already decided that I must live to support her mistress. Okay. What? <gasps> I'm sorry for queaking. Oh my god, I can play as this guy. This is so cool. The second floor has lots of private rooms. I tr I try the first floor. A row of pots. Do you have a chainsaw too? No, you don't. <laughs> Let's say it. You don't even have an inventory. Four pots, a large sofa. He's so small. <laughs> it's so cute. What? What are you up to here? Oh my, I didn't know he uh he met Ogre. This is weird. Ah my my, how good to see you're safe. Has that knife wound healed up already? You appear to have recovered quite well. Thanks to that medicine of yours. Good. Good. Who in the world are you? You're not from this mansion. And you don't seem dead to me. I'm just a passing salesman. Oh man, so many references right now to the other games. If you know what I mean, just watch Wada Nohara and the Grey Garden. You know what I'm talking about. So many passing mysterious characters. And it's always the same. It's always the passing ones. <laughs> okay. Can I go here? No. Fit of condiments, a clean glass stove, a wagon for tableware, completely devoured, taste. Cupboards are a mess, cupboards are a mess. Okay. Let's talk to you again. You're drinking tea. <laughs> I witnessed some amusing sights indeed tonight. Love is a truly magnificent thing, isn't it? For love, people will become crazed, fighting and hurting each other. How foolish and how pleasing. You're enjoying all this? And if I said I was, the hell is your goal? <laughs> I have no goal, so to speak. What? I just enjoy observing deranged humans. 
Why is he looking so creepy? Oh, this is weird. This is weird, but it's cool. I like it. Even, even he's like, uh... You are not human, are you? <laughs> well, but as of late, I've gotten a bit bored with mere observation. I decided to find some new amusement. Indeed, perhaps I, like he, will take part in a puppet show. Oh, shut up! <laughs> Whoa, now you know. I like virtuous humans like yourself as well. It wouldn't be entertaining if this world were full of nothing but lunatics. It is the presence of good people that allows lunatics to shine. <laughs> Such is why I didn't let you die. So if you would, please stand against the madman with your justice. When the time comes for it, I'll be watching closely. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm looking exactly the same as he is right now. I'm like, what is going on anymore? What did he mean with puppet show? And what? The father already died at this point, right? So, it's so weird. Let's look around. It's a vase of flowers. Oh. Vase of flowers. Oh yeah, this is the before he, before he, gave Aya the charm, like the kiss on the, on the forehead. Does does he find the kiss here? Charm encyclopedia. Yes, this is it, right? Now he finds it. What? Boy birthing charm. Girls are cute, but sometimes you just want a healthy boy. For this, use a boy birthing charm. The charm is very simple. First make your bed covers an old blue color. Then just pray every night before bed. This, is, this alone increases the chance of birthing a boy. Isn't that wonderful? Wait. So, in Aya's version, you saw this good luck charm like... Like yeah, like some information you have, you need, so you can understand some things, like the part where he kisses her and something like this. But this does it mean the mother wanted a boy? This is weird. Okay. Let's see. Whoa, a vase of flowers, a toilet, nothing in the laundry, neatly folded towels. Youngster. Oh wait, what's what's the what what did the voice cue I gave him? I don't know, but I remember you, man. The youngster. You first came here as a servant too, a bit. Same for me, but I wasn't like the others. I was taken in to be a servant, not as raw materials. It was back when a woman was alive. As I worked here, I came to learn the true nature of his family. I fled in terror, fast as I could, but I couldn't make it away. Well, I was pretty clever about it, too, but, but that woman saw right through me. She is scary sharp, she is. A woman who can read minds, can brainwash people, no problem. Yeah, she will and truly tricks you. Do you mean to imply Monica Branch washed that scientist? Whatever kind of person she is, her feelings about her daughter are real. She's a fine mother. <laughs> well, what do I care? You can think what you like. Okay, so can I get the shiny thing? I was taken. Uh, maybe if I hadn't tried running away, it wouldn't have killed me after all. Okay. Can't I get a shiny thing there? Hmm. Okay. 
Hmm. I can't get outside. I think this goes down to a basement. I'll check the other rooms. Oh. Hello. Ah, good. You woke up. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, look how she cute she looks. Oh. <laughs> I'm terribly sorry. My mistress seems a bit shy. Oh, she's so shy. You've decided to leave the mansion. Right, that sounds good. Uh we're going uh we're going to leave all our past behind in this mansion. The mistress and I will start on a new life now. Is something the matter? You don't look pleased. Be careful of that red eyed man in the black coat. What do you mean? Better not to ask that. He's dangerous to even get involved with. It may even endanger the mistress. Very probable. I bear it in mind. Hmm. Well, this is goodbye. Oh. <laughs> and he still does the charm. This is so cute. I think she had she uh, he had to do it. <laughs> goodbye, Aya. May you be smiled upon. So damn cute, man. <laughs> Please come with us. Now go. Goodbye. Oh, man. That's some heavy stuff, man. Can I move? Oh, no, I can't. Oh, he is. Oh, he looks so sad. Oh, this is a different one. I didn't saw this one. Oh, it's so cute. Back to a lonely life again. Oh, he's lonely. My life here was my salvation. Even given that. Even given what happened here. There. Still, she saved me. Those few days were irreplaceable. Her hands may have been cold, but her heart was so warm. Why did she save me, though? I wish I at least knew that. Wait. Does that mean... Th he talks about cold hands. Does he mean the mother? Did the mother save him before he, like, completely died? Aren't you going with him? Huh? A doll? <laughs> Guess the curse hasn't worn off completely. Oh. Hey, don't you want to go with Aya? Won't you be lonely? I can't be with the two of them. If they learned I was alive, I feel like they made me pay. They're trying to move forward, so I can't be dragging them down. Oh, that's so sad! So I'll be living on a different path from them. Oh, okay. However you like. So however you like. Yes, I'll do as I please. Hey, do you believe in the string of fate? If you and Aya and Maria are bound by one of us, then you might meet somewhere again. So long as we live in the same world, I can't deny that could happen. If you meet again, what will you do if I have Aya's taken the same path as her father? Oh, oh she talks about the trending! What do you mean? <laughs> what else would I mean? Don't they say that? The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. It's impossible. She knows which subjects pain better than anyone. To think she would take the same path as him. I mean, I said, if. 
Well, what would you do? Then I would stop her. Could you stop her? I will try to, no doubt. Hmm. <laughs> well, good luck. Oh, I'm getting kinda tired. I'm going to bed. Good night. Good night. That was very interesting. So the blonde guy did live. He is alive and he still is like walking around. But what did he mean they won't make him pay like in the sense of that? Let's, let's just think about it. Aya was saved. She's going with Maria. That's, that's all right. And now he says that he's alive, but he doesn't want to go with him because he could remind them about the past because he was the subject. But I don't understand why why would we make him pay? Like for what? He didn't do anything like he didn't kill anyone. Okay, he killed her father. Maybe maybe that's why? I don't know. But he really wanted to go with her, I think, but he couldn't because maybe she wouldn't understand because she's only like 10, 11 and she won't understand like things like I did it just for you because love and stuff. She only knew know the love of family and she only starts her new life so... It's interesting, it's... But that's a good ending. I like it, I like this way. Okay. Um, so I'm, let's try the other endings. Wait, no, I, I'll do this in an extra part. But right now I want to thank you very much for uh, watching, even if it took so long to record every part. Uh, I'm very glad that you watched it and I hope you will always. You all also did like it, like I did, because this game, this game was gorgeous. The art style is phenomenal. There were voices, there were music. Sen is a great, is a great maker. He did a good job with Mad Father, and I think I, I think I said it before, but this is supposed to be a. Like supposed to be like the story before the next game I'm going to play and this is going to be Misao and Misao is like the sequel I think in some way or another like you find bits and pieces of this game there again because it's the same creator of course but I don't know how the stories are connected but let's see we'll see it in my next let's play and you know it will be Misao or something else. I don't know what you guys want, but right now you know my plans. And in the extra part I will show you, maybe even after this little cut here, uh, I'll show you the other endings that this game has. But until then, thank you very much for joining the story with me. I very much liked it, enjoyed it. And yeah, thank you for everything. And we'll see each other in the next let's play. But until then, see ya. Hello everyone and welcome to this little short clip, I think. Where we see the last endings. I think I will maybe even put it on the last part that I already told you about, but never mind that. Let's just get into it. So I think the first one was here. Yes, we could help Maria or go away. And right now, Maria's going to... Let's ignore her Maria and leave, like... <laughs> like being an ass and just leave. I wonder what will happen now. Well, 
Let's just make it like this. No. <laughs> I found you. Uh oh. Move. I am move. Yes. Okay. What? Oh. <laughs> Come be with us. No. We already saw this part, but let's just watch it again. Maybe something changes. It's going to change. That's enough of our game of tag, Aya. I have to keep you still, don't I? Uh-oh. No. Let go! I didn't want to hurt you, Aya. It's a shame. No. Stop, father. But I can cover your leg with a skirt easily enough. So it should be fine. I don't want this. I wanted to stay with father. I love you, father. So please, stop this. Aya... Don't worry. Father and Aya will always be together now. So rest in peace, Aya. I love you. Uh. Uh. Okay. So he actually did. Oh no, he did it. <gasps> Maria died prob probably like Aya fought and the father killed her because no one helped her. Oh, damn it. This chain reaction, man. Ah, yeah. You drew na- You drew nas- <laughs> You- Ah, yeah. Your new dress looks wonderful on you. Oh, no. You made her into a damn doll. Well, it's about time to sleep. So this was the chair in the room. Like, I saw this chair before, but I didn't know why the chair was there. And I see, so it was the chair prepared for Aya to sit on it. Good night, Aya. No, I don't like this ending. Yeah, bad end, I thought so. Okay, this was the first bad end. The other one is probably the other world darkness and now I'm going to skip everything because I don't want to read everything again that's going to happen now. So you can see my awesome skipping skills. Okay, let's skip it forward. Yeah. We saw it already. In a other scene. This is how I played through the game a second time. Only if you were curious. I'm just holding the escape button and I'm like... God damn it, Simon. Why do I have to play it again? The mom is made. Oh yeah, see it. The father is dead. Everything is creep. And I can try him. But I try. And she did it. Not for long. It's kinda scary to see it, <laughs> to see the scene in fast forward. Okay, now we won't save Fiver because he's a crazy psychomaniac and we will grant mom's wish. Let's see what will happen now. I'm sorry, father. Mom, she loves you more than anyone else. I can take you away from mom. Uh, yeah. I'm sorry. Oh, 
Yeah, I saw this. This I saw this one. And yeah, now he's being like dragged into the other world, and he's being all dead. And now she's all alone here. Where am I? Did I make it back? It's just me. Huh. So, and... Well, I can save again. Well, let's save... Human. Okay. Seems similar. <gasps> Okay, so it's one of the things that we see packed with junk. Maybe it's one of the subjects. Seems familiar. Doll has such big eyes. Making doll looks lonely. A stuffed something. A bright mannequin doll seems alive. Someone sleeps inside. Woo. Oh, drums, dirty. But I'm just checking everything just in case. Not to miss any secrets. I'm going to look at this other thing in a moment. Okay, let's save again. Can only save here, apparently. Oh, I just. Whoa. Filled of blood. Okay, so we can't see the mother's corpse now. That's a mannequin. This was the whole scene. It won't open. Yeah, this is the whole scene, like, where we run away and stuff. We'll never... Oh, Maria. Maria. Hmm. <sighs> Where is this? Mistress? There's the doctor. What happened to him? Mistress, the doctor. No. He... Doctor. Doctor. Hmm. Yeah, he's dead. A moment of silence for the doctor. <laughs> it's so quiet. The curse must have faded. And father's gone. I'm sure this is for the best. No one will get will be hurt by father's by father's experience. Experiments anymore. I can't read. <laughs> You'd say the same thing, Mom. But now what do I do? I don't have a father or a mother. I'm alone. No, I shouldn't say that. After all, I have to live alone from now on. Oh, she's in this ending. She's going to be alone, huh? Maria, what will you do? You can't just stay here since father's gone. Oh, and she's sad. But if you have nowhere to go, then uh, Maria, <laughs> what? Huh? What? This is, uh, yeah, this is the thing we saw before, but I didn't know what it was, so it's in this ending. Hey, why? Why did Maria do this? Uh-oh. Doctor, you are with us no longer. But please, take heart. I shall take on the duty. The future you wish for the mistress. I shall see it out. So please, rest in peace. 
Doctor. I love you. Damn it. Bad end, of course. Okay. So, this was all of the endings. Let's see. Did I saw everything? Yeah, this is it. This is uh, the thing we didn't see before, but this is Aya. As a doll. This is even what it says, doll. So yeah, in the one ending Maria makes her into a doll and the other the father, so in the end the other two endings makes she becomes a doll. Alright. So this was Mad Father everyone, I hope you enjoyed it all. I enjoyed it very much. It, it has a very dark story, like you made a little girl and her whole family is messed up apparently. I don't know what's up with her mother and her father, like, I thought the father was the main culprit, but when we, when we saw with the blonde guy, the root, the mother apparently was a little bit twisted herself, only towards Aya, they were both kind. Maria is kind of weird and twisted too, if it comes to love. So in the end, it's all the, it's all as Ogre said. Everyone has become crazed because of his love for, the other, for another person. This is interesting. So... Don't... Uh, I think what this, what this game wants to tell us is... Be careful of a mad father. And don't let go... <laughs> and don't let love go over your head. Don't become a crazy lunatic who kills people just because you love someone else or whatever there's no excuse for that so yeah stay normal people and i hope you enjoyed this let's play i said it probably before uh, before already but we'll see each other in the next part uh, and into the next uh, project let's play whatever we'll see each other in the next part of something until then See ya.